I'm Susan Friedman with Sienna, and I'm here with John Hawkins, who's Sienna's product marketing manager, and we're talking about a new uh, solution that you just announced this week. Can you tell me about it, John? Yes, here we uh, announced the DNFVI, which is the Distributed Network Function Virtualization Infrastructure Solution from Sienna. It consists of several uh, components, several parts. Uh, one, a new piece of hardware called, called the 3906 MVI for Modular Virtual Infrastructure. Uh, the 3906 is a six gig uh, ethernet switch that joins our uh, already rich uh, ethernet switching family, uh, but it adds to it a modular uh, field replaceable server unit which can accept uh, uh, virtual functions like a firewall, an encryptor, uh, a virtual router, any number of functions that the industry is, uh, is clamoring for right now in a virtualized software fashion. Which leads us to the second element of the solution, which is the operating system and the uh, virtual switch that lives on that server uh, to accommodate those virtual network functions. Uh, we call that just the DNFEI software. Uh, and it is uh, containerized, modularized, so that uh, a, a provider can pick and choose the parts of the solution that uh, they are interested in, combine it with other uh, industry solutions if they like in a very open fashion, uh, and put together really the best in-class uh, answer to their particular challenge. Third element of the solution is one that's already well known, which is the Blue Planet uh, orchestration, um, uh, uh, multi-domain orchestration suite of software. So it orchestrates the distribution of these virtual functions across not only a Sienna domain, but any other domain that might exist in the network operator's environment yeah, anyway. So it stitches this all together. Uh, and then finally, we've associated that with a series of professional services that. Uh, offers our customer the opportunity to uh, use our expertise to plan, engineer, deploy, even operate and uh, maintain their service on an, on an ongoing basis. So it's really a multifaceted, very uh, uh, rich uh, answer to the distributed NFEI uh, challenge that is out there. So it sounds like this combination of systems, software, and services is really giving the service provider and the user a lot of choice. That's right, it's really about options. It's really the, the, the industry is moving toward a more open environment where you do not have to lock in to one vendor's solution. Uh, and so we are trying to provide the, uh, the, the, the bones onto which to hang the, the best in class solution for uh, whatever the particular challenge might be. So there are are open questions or are options around what VNFs are of value and can deliver value to the end user. So there's a mix of uh, opportunities out there above and beyond just the basic connectivity, which is what we normally uh, specialize in selling, which is connecting points A and B and C. But uh, in addition, to just connecting those points now, we want to add, uh, add or layer on top of that additional services but in a virtualized manner with no truck rolls uh, and, and with a lot of automation to bring down the cost of those managed services. So it really is about building a framework onto which to offer any number of, uh, of options to our service provider customers. And could you just unpack it a little bit for me and, and describe for me, what is DNFE? So NFE is the network function virtualization concept that is really uh, caught fire in the industry in the last uh, couple of years, which is uh, replacing individualized one per box functions uh, with virtualized versions thereof that run in software on a more generic processor. That's the point of the 3906 MVI processor module. The distributed part, the D in the acronym, comes from the fact that many of those functions belong out on the edge of the network. So if you are going to encrypt your traffic end to end, you really need to start the encryption right where you enter that network and unencrypt it right as you leave that network. Just one example. Security functions, if you're trying to build a firewall, um, if you want to make the, uh, the WAN link the last mile, sometimes it's called uh, more efficient by either compressing that data or using some algorithm to mirror cache some of that data. Those functions belong out on the edge of the network, hence distributed. When you do that, you incur some challenges. Uh, the edge of the network is sometimes not as well behaved. 
Uh, so you need to have uh, uh, strategies for protecting that part of the network, for making it reliable. Uh, sometimes it is uh, a smaller pipe than the core of the network, so you need to make better use of that by maybe compressing your data or doing something uh, innovative around the use of that WAN link. So several of these functions belong out on the edge of the network, therefore they incur these, uh, these challenges, and our software stack is intended to address those specific challenges that are brought about by the distributed nature of that, uh, of that problem. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for sharing your knowledge. Um, I really enjoyed this conversation. Thanks, John. Thank you.